Hello everybody, Slava Mirudek here. Today I would like to show you my first video about uh, analyzing telemetry. And for this purpose we'll be using Motec i2 Pro, which is one of the most, I think, uh, popular um, analyzing programs uh, in the world. Okay, so um, first thing um, we have to do is, of course, to download the the program from from the website uh, we go to the main website we just google Motec and the first um, first link is the main website we go to downloads then to software and then we are looking for i2 pro this is the current version 1.21 and this is important to not uh, download i2 standard we download i2 pro okay we click and then we download and install uh, in this video i don't want to show how to um, how to run um, how to set up the um, the sensors or uh, whatever because uh, this is uh, well very difficult stuff to be honest but what is very interesting about this particular program is that you can use the same program this version i2 pro for analyzing either real racing telemetry from real cars or you can analyze telemetry from sim racing games like uh, factor 2 factor 1 uh, iRacing, for instance, uses uh, another mm, program which is called mm, McLaren Atlas. Uh, and this program, McLaren Atlas, is used in uh, real Formula One, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, so we downloaded the program, we installed it, and of course, we run, as, run it as an administrator. And this mm, thing should appear. We want to create a new project. So, of course, this is will help you to create a new project. We click next, and then, of course, we select uh, from available profiles. Uh, we are interested in circuit uh, telemetry. So, we click, we select circuit, then mm, next. And project name, let's say um, my first project. Of course, we use project location, and we can set use profile worksheets and math. Okay, we click mm, next, and then we have a summary, and we click finish. Of course, the, these options are in Polish, but the program itself is, is fully in English, so it won't be a problem. Okay, and this window appears, and what we have here is ready workbook. Ready workbook with a lot of uh, things to analyze. Mm, these are workbooks. We have seven workbooks here. And each workbook consists of uh, several worksheets. Mm, so uh, you can, frankly speaking, you can use uh, this uh, uh, this uh, ready workbook, uh, ready project. But uh, I suggest to delete everything and to create uh, a new brand new project uh, suited to your preferences which you like because here you, you have a lot of a lot of information of course very valuable and important information but still uh, I think your own project is is much much better okay uh, so let's start from from nothing so let's uh, Let's delete everything. Yes, I want it takes some time, of course. 
what what we can do okay actually um, if you analyze real telemetry you you don't need that much uh, info I mean you don't uh, it's unnecessary okay here we can just um, delete all workbooks so let's do this now suspension tires uh, well we can't we have to leave at least one but of course we can rename it so it's not a problem okay so we have in my case black uh, screen because I I prefer black background rather than white uh, all the ch I see where the chart so but it can be changed uh, in tools options and colors here you have all the colors okay so let's really start creating our new project uh, 